Natalie McQueen and I play Lauren in the Western cast of Kinky Boots and I'm going to be seeing History of Rock Guys. Probably the most fun I've ever had 
on a show. Um, what you're singing about every night becomes exactly how you're feeling in, in this amazing company, and not just on stage, but off stage as well. Um, it's the most fun. Like sometimes you have to remind yourself that it's like a job, like you're, it doesn't feel like that ever. It's amazing. Absolutely the dream. Yeah, basically, yeah. <laughs> it's the dream job. I get to be silly and, and have the most fun with the most incredible group of people. It's great. And you're playing Lauren. Let's talk a bit about her yeah. and talk about a bit about the song that you just yeah. performed. Um, Lauren is not that too far away from who I am as a person. Um, and I get loads of people at stage door actually saying like, oh my God, that's the story of my life. <laughs> and actually, you even said it to me. Um, <laughs> um, it's, she's really misunderstood and she's a bit, you know, she tries to be cool, but she's not cool. Um, and she just wants to find someone, but she keeps falling into the traps that everyone falls into. And that song is fun because, yeah, it's funny and on stage I get to you know, be silly, but it's, at the bottom line of it is, she, she's just falling for the wrong guys and she's caught herself again, again. Um, but uh, she's, she's a fun one to play because actually you see her go from kind of like a bit of a kid, even though she's an adult, um, to, to be really be, uh, becoming herself. It's great. Yeah. Um, and we think that was a kinky first, don't we? Yeah, I'm not sure. It is a kinky first. It is a kinky first. I we've never performed History of Wrong Guys out of the theatre, I believe. Hurrah! Yeah. Yeah. And it was here. Hooray! <laughs> yeah. yeah, fantastic. And what's it like performing it here in the amazing theatre cafe? Um, it's so fun. I've only been here a couple of times before, and um, it's great because this place is amazing. Like, I wish this was here when I loved, like, was like growing up and like wanting to be in theatre because. You get, hello. You get to um, you get to come, get to uh, come here and listen to great music and be around people that are like-minded. Um, and yeah, it's uh, it's been great. I'm very honoured to be asked to perform it. And we're very honoured to have you. you. We have had a few uh, questions oh. sent in. Oh. Number one is a tricky one. Yep. What would your angel name be? So for those that haven't seen the show, I know, that's a tricky one, isn't it? For those of people that haven't seen the show, what are the angels? Um, the angels are um, Lola's uh, crew, I suppose. Um, uh, they are the most incredible group of guys that wear heels higher than I've ever worn, better makeup, um, incredible hair, and they dance and sing and they're phenomenal and they are with Lola all the time um, and they all have they all um, have a ceremony where they name they cut their own names and Lola um, uh, yeah, gives them their give them their drag names so we've got things like um, what have we got? We've got Page Three um, we've got Keisha Lorraine I think is one of them uh, I'm trying to remember them all now uh, I think mine would be um, Patio Jaws <laughs> like it, yeah. I mean, yeah. That's, yeah. Or yeah. The other day, someone said something in warm up, and we realised uh, someone said a oh, great drag name. It was Anna Rack. Yeah. Anna Rack. <laughs> Very good. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, good. Yeah, good. Right. Uh, what's your favourite part of the show? Uh, everybody say yeah. Oh, mine too. Yeah. Takes everyone into act two, yeah. uh, into the interval on high. Yeah. yeah. Fabulous. What other character in Kinky Boots would you like to play? Lola. Oh, yes. <laughs> Lola, 100%, like 110%. Um, it would be so, hello. It would be so much fun. I would love it. Um, I, but only if I was like Simon doing it, because he's so phenomenal, which yeah. would not be the case. It would be like a really, really rubbish version. But I'd love to do that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, and final, final question. Have you got any other dream roles? Um... Um, uh, yeah, <laughs> I, well, I've just recently been listening to Mean Girls because someone at work told me to listen to it and Janice is like, oh, so much fun. But I would love to go back to Wicked and I'd love to play Elf for that. Because yeah. I covered it, but I would love to do it all the time. I just had the most fun and like, that's another great show with another great message. Mm -hmm. um, I think I'd love to do that, but I'll take anything. <laughs>
<laughs> yes, you heard it here first. Anything, absolutely anything. <laughs> well, thank you so much for coming in. It's been an absolute pleasure to have, to have you here. Um, you can buy tickets for Kinky Boots. I'm going to put a link onto all of our little bits that we post everywhere, so you can click straight on the link. And uh, Kinky Boots is currently playing at the Adelphi Theatre until the something 12. of January, 12th of January. So make sure that you get to see it before it goes. And if you don't get to see it in London, it is then going on a national tour. So you have no excuse. Go and see this fabulous show. It's absolutely stunning and one of our favourites. So make sure you go. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you guys. And this has been the Theatre Cafe. Thanks everyone. Bye. <laughs>